The community of Roselle, Illinois is served by a wastewater treatment plant with a permitted plant design average day of 2 million gallons and 4 million gallons per day max, serving a population of 14,000. Their actual 2010 average was 1.6 million gallons per day, and they operated 4 million gallons per day during wet weather. Peak process flow is about 6 million gallons per day. In general, their influent is dilute. The average 2010 biochemical oxygen demand was 98 milligrams per liter, and suspended solids were 108 milligrams per liter. The wastewater treatment plant is a conventional activated sludge process. Primary clarifier underflow and activated sludge are blended and dewatered by belt presses before being trucked to a storage site and land applied. Roselle had two belt presses that were approximately 20 years old, with high maintenance hours and costs to keep operational. Performance had become an issue, as it took at least three days and up to five days per week to process the needed 36 cubic yards, leaving little time for maintenance. City Public Works staff and their consultant requested in-person presentations by several dewatering equipment manufacturers, followed by question and answer sessions, and follow-up justification documentation on each company's process recommendations. Responses ranged from belt press widths of 0.75 meter to 1.5 meters to handle the projected process flows. After careful consideration, the staff and consultant concluded that a one-meter unit was to be bid, then selected three vendors, one being BDP Industries for their Model 3DP belt press. They issued bid specifications based on the selected belt press manufacturers and stipulated direct bids to the city rather than contractors to ensure one of the selected manufacturers would be the basis of the facility design. BDP Industries was the low bidder, due in large part that the platform and stairs were significantly smaller and conveyor arrangements shorter versus the other competitors. BDP Industries then worked closely with the consultant in designing the facility. A construction bid process was then conducted, a contract awarded, and the facility was built. Performance of the BDP 1 meter model 3DP has exceeded expectations. The overall quality has been phenomenal. I haven't seen any rust spots or anything of that nature after the amount of time that we've been running. Um, everything seems to be working great and, and far uh, exceeds our expectations. Expanding on why Ron is so pleased, they used to alternate operating one of the two meter units, three eight hour days per week, in order to waste the needed 36 cubic yards per week. With the new one meter model 3DP unit, they only need to operate one day per week. This is three times the capacity on a unit that is only one half the belt width. This represents six times the solids loading capacity. The old units typically produced 13% to 14% cake solids. With the new BDP one meter press, they now get 17%. The staff at Roselle has been extremely satisfied with the resulting layout and accessibility for operation and maintenance. We were pressing sometimes three, four, five days a week. This is a one meter press, and we now can press one day a week, maybe two. It's, it's a phenomenal improvement. We're, we're pleased with the outcome. Bottom line, the selection of BDP Industries Model 3DP belt press has significantly lowered operational and maintenance costs and is producing a dewatered product that has lowered transportation costs.